Hey, what's going on, guys? It is Zero Gravity Gaming here. Welcome to part number two of how to build a custom track for NR2003. So, where we left off, we left off with making the F sections. So, let's get right into this. So, first, you're going to want to select the first F section down here on the bottom, and then go into your next one into your other window for sandbox. So click unlock the all material or unlock materials. Scroll down, select grass, and then I think racing surface. Now here in all of these you're gonna scroll down until you get to grass. Here we go. Now you can, if you move this down, you can actually see what they all look like. <coughs> so, let's see which one actually looks the best. I think probably grass.mit. So here, what you're going to want to do, you're going to put that at 1, and then put this one at 1 as well. And then you can go here, and then you're going to want to leave enough room in between them all. Okay, so you're going to want to leave enough room in between the F section and the X section. Um, now, move up to the next one. Go back into this. So, it dep it's all up to you guys whether you want an asphalt track or a concrete track. For me, I'm doing concrete. So now I need to find... I saw a good one here. Gray concrete? That actually looks good, but I'm going to look at the other concrete that there is. Um, here we go. So that one, this one, nope. This one, and this one. Ooh, this would be good for the apron. Um, I think I'm going to use... Oh, wait. If I'm going to use that, then should I use, yeah, concrete. And then here, you're going to want to do one, and then four. So yeah, so when you're done that, now you just go back into here. Now, for here, this is going to be the apron for me. So I'm going to go into here, concrete, apron. No, I passed it. Okay. So, there. I move that up. One, four, and two. And four. There we go, that works. Now the line is there. Now I'm just going to edit this so that it'll work too. Two and four. There, now they actually meet up. Okay, so now here, oh, I might actually want to add a few more. Insert an F section. So yeah, I think from here to here, that'll be pit road, or maybe from here to, so from here to here, and then here to here, that'll be pit stalls. So from here, so this will be, yeah, that pit road. What am I doing? Right here. Ok, 
Okay, what do these all look like? That. Nope. 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 Maybe. Whoops. Nope. No. Maybe. 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 And then. Oh yeah, which one was it? It had a bunch of lines in it. Or this one. No, that'll work for, um, the pit stall. I was going to use asphalt.mip. So one. I'll do one and one so that it's really clear. Okay, there we go. Now this one. Asphalt pit stall. <laughs> what did these ones look like? Oh. Okay, so it's this one. One and one. Four. Four. Nah, yeah, that looks good. <clears throat> now, this one here. This one I think I'll just do grass. Grass. Apron near pits. Grass.mip. One and four. No, one and one. I think is what I did. I'll see. Yeah. Okay, so there is our first segment done. So, now, on to the W sections. So you're going to want to right click here, insert, W section. Now go W section properties. <coughs> um, wall. Bracing surface, I think. Now the right walls. Scroll all the way down. Here. I'll do wall.nip. Now you can leave these here. You're going to want it to go vertical and curved. Um, what am I wanting to do here? One, one. That, I think. Two. Now for the top. Scroll all the way down, once again, wall top, oh, okay, now for this, this will be interesting, 0 0.50, 0. hang on, wait, no, we want safer barriers, right, uh, hang on, where's S, soft wall, here we go, Soft walk top. Three and three. No, one. One. Nope. Two. Three. Four. No, we want two. Three. There. I don't know what I want. <coughs> 0 0.50 0 0.50 Okay, now here I want 1 then. Um, then I need to go back to the right side and soft wall 1 1 Okay. Left <coughs> Now this here, okay, 
soft wall soft wall side one and one okay so here go into view camera view mode slew mode okay I did the wall facing the wrong way so I need to So for the right walls, we need to do soft wall side dot mip. Left walls, just soft wall dot mip. Okay, here we go. View camera view. Here we go. That looks better. Okay. Oh yeah, and also when you're in the camera view, select slew mode. Right click is to move forward, left click to move backwards, um, and spacebar to freeze the camera. Where it is. So now, don't move it up to it, up to the uh, F section line. So it's 3368. I think I can move it up a little more. 3363. There we go. Now let's go view, camera view, slew mode. That looks pretty good. And that works. Okay, now. If you're doing a road course, you don't want to catch fence. But if you aren't, you do. So go insert W section, go into your W section properties, wire fence left, leave that like that, left walls only, hang on, nope then it's down here, so in F, should be fence fence let's do this one four curved now hang on there's negative zero point two hundred zero negative 0 0.200 like that negative 0 0.400 negative 0 0.400 negative 0 0 0.600 then negative 0 0.800 and then I think this is negative 0 0.500 and then negative 0 0.0.600 0 I think it's like this or something let me go camera view and check okay now it's facing the okay so take off all the negatives <coughs> Get rid of that, 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 and that. There, now let's go camera view, slew mode. Okay, great. I did this wrong. I'm pretty sure I did this wrong. Okay. So, what am I doing wrong? Is it supposed to be one is negative and one isn't? Okay, that happens if I do that. 